Here's a demo of opening in a new tab with Wix code. So, let's create this. Now, keep in mind that Wix has a feature of opening in a new tab using a button. And this will work. Wix, unfortunately, does not offer inside the code a feature to open in a new tab. However, I made a workaround with HTML frames. As you can see, there's an HTML frame here. So let's say that we want to open up example.com when clicking on this box. OK, so the first step is I'm going to create an event handler so that when this box is clicked, the code in here is going to run. Now, what you do is I have this code in the description, and it will uh, receive a message from Wix code and then when it receives that message it's going to click this link which can open in a new tab so essentially it's receiving the message from the Wix code then it's going to select this ahref and then it's going to open uh, it's going to click on the link which is target blank, meaning it opens in the new tab. Take this code and replace this href with your website. So let's do spacex.com. Make sure you have the HTTP at the front. Now take this code, copy it, create an HTML frame, which you could do by going to add, embed, embed widget, and then enter this code. So just paste it in and hit update. Okay, so now we're gonna say we're gonna post a message. This script runs when it has a message. So we are going to say HTML2 dot post message and then whatever message we set. So if message equals post message argument. You can change this to whatever your message wants to be. So I'm going to change it to open. Okay? So if I change it to open here, I'm going to write the same thing in here, open. If you wrote if you wrote foo, then change it to foo. Okay? So now what this code does is when this red rectangle is clicked, it runs this event handler goes in here, selects HTML2, sends a message called foo. Then inside of here, it receives the message, and then there's a conditional. If the message is foo, then it's going to click on its own link, okay, which is going to open in a new page. So the last thing we do is click this hidden check mark here. So what that will do is this HTML frame will still be there. So its code will still run, but it will be hidden. That way it doesn't interfere with your site. So now we're done. If you hit preview, and now if you click on the box, it goes to SpaceX.com. And it doesn't have to be clicking either. You can run this code. This code will open in a new tab. So in this case, I said when this is clicked, it's going to run this code. But I could do, for example, on mouse in, okay? So now I'm gonna delete this. Now if I put it in on mouse in event handler, it will open a new tab. I don't have to click. I'm just gonna go in and then it opens. Right? Just like that. So get creative, use this, and I hope this helped.